war. War never changes. The truth is. In this world, you are kept safe. Vault 66 protects us from radiation, disaster, and much worse. Wastelanders now roam the land, doing as they please without laws or rules. Even worse, robotic humans known as synths weave their way through society. And worse, mutants, monsters, and dangerous beasts seek to destroy us all. Luckily, some are very special. They will survive long enough to endure the fallout and help rebuild our world. Welcome to Fallout Origins. Eve, the vault has a literal missile in it. We got to get to work at our base here. We need to create another vault. Like we need to have a vault room set up or else we're going to have some big problems here if they end up letting that missile accidentally go off or something so we really need to work on making a safe room here somewhere where we know everything is going to be safe in the event the missile goes off i can go ahead and get myself rested up in a vault we're gonna have to rebuild one i wasn't planning on doing this but you know sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do all right so let's go ahead and get started we got a lot of different materials here so let's go ahead and start filling in the walls a little bit but we did steal a few of the materials from the vault and then i crafted more when we got back so we should be plenty full in the resources necessary to build a vault room but we shall see how all that goes let's go ahead and get started here with the walls this is going to be difficult though i'm not going to lie because like i've never really had to build a vault room before but we definitely need to do it because like who knows like there's a nuclear missile on there like those guys they were pretty weird when they like found it. i'm not gonna lie they were pretty weird people so you never know like are they going to accidentally set it off quote unquote or like what's gonna happen for now we'll just throw torches all over the place but we'll eventually change that and i know it's not symmetrical but there's bigger priorities in the event of a <laughs> nuclear fallout than it being symmetrical so let's go ahead and work on the vault like we're literally rebuilding the vault like high key and this should be low enough in the the map in the world that if a missile does go off we will be able to survive the actual explosion and then all we have to do is just stop the radiation so it's definitely doable but we're gonna go ahead we gotta make a pretty impressive vault because who knows like do we invite everybody else like you know what i mean or do we just invite us like I don't know like i feel like we got to try to help everybody so we're gonna need a lot of space because this here is not gonna be big enough for everybody so we're gonna need to expand it onward for sure but you know we got a little bit of time here so today we're just gonna start the vault because we really need to get it started and then we're gonna use some of these for the top because these are probably the most resistant as far as blast proof goes i mean they're literally blocks of iron so this should work we did I um, have to spend a lot of time though getting a ton of this stuff but it was worth it because you know obviously like I don't want to have another nuclear wasteland situation so you know we gotta stay safe up here like that good stuff and now what we're gonna do is we are going to well I pick these back up right here now let's go ahead and get started on like another level here I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna go for a staircase sort of thing just because we're gonna need to like straight up we're gonna need to do something crazy like this where we have like multiple levels because you never know like how many people are gonna be here you know what i mean like it's quite possible it'll be a large variety of people different vault dwellers and wastelanders like do we let the wastelanders in like if something was to happen of course this is all hypothetical but you just like i want to be prepared you know what i mean because like no one was prepared for the last one and i want to be prepared for this one so you like you know what i'm saying like we got to try to be prepared compared to the last one so let's go ahead and just get all these filled in here and we just need to go a little bit lower so that way we can actually make this into a room down here and then we're just going to make a big room and then of course we're going to worry about like getting all the essentials down here at a later date like we are going to of course need to you know get actual rooms set up and such so let's go ahead and do something uh here like this level here this level here is the perfect one for us to start the actual 
room building process so let's go ahead and just start digging out the space here you know we got to make a good amount of progress here today on this because like i mean the missile's been there for a hot minute but i'm pretty sure they're gonna be collecting it within like the near future like i mean they're not gonna leave it there forever right i mean that would probably be pretty weird but who knows let's go ahead and do something like this i guess we can get started on a roof situation pretty soon for this area down here just because that's gonna be a thing we need to do like we need to get a roof on this place like what if the missile does go off like if it doesn't go off it's not the end of the world like you know but if it doesn't like get set off well then we still have a vault for you know like if we ever needed to stay safe for a prolonged period of time or things like that but if like uh we're stuck how the heck is this even happening but like if you know bad things happen like what do you want me to do if i don't have like a nice little safe area like we do here so we got like a good safe spot you know so there's that okay here we go let's get started on the rooftop all right so again we want our roofs to be made out of the iron blocks because they're the most blast resistant that's why the missile was surrounded by them and we're gonna do something like that there we go and yes this is gonna be our vault we are going to need to rebuild the vault and it's gonna be a little bit different than the previous one it's actually gonna be better than the previous one i think just because you know this one here is actually gonna be made out of like stronger materials and it's more like hidden and you know all sorts of things like that it's just gonna be the way we need it to be like all i'm saying is like i'm not trying to be another overseer because like you know the overseer was murdered at the vault and well like the overseer the owner of the vault like they tend to get murdered so uh i don't really want to be an overseer so let's just keep that i'm making this like on the down low like don't let other people know okay we can't let other people know just straight up because if we do like, i might get murdered and i don't want to get murdered so i can't really tell anybody about this right now i think like i don't know can i trust anybody that's the real question that's really what i gotta figure out is is there people i should tell that i can trust you know what i mean I don't really know we'll have to see we got to go ahead and get a floor placed in into this vault room here let's do this floor has been dug out and now all we got to do is actually place it in to the room so let's go ahead and get the floor placed. and we're going to use this black factory block it should be pretty pretty blast resistant and honestly at this low of a level here this this room area is less for the blast resistance and more of just like a it's safer from radiation but b you also have to factor in like who knows how many people i'm gonna have down here so we need to be like you know full-blown like prepared for a lot of people down here for a prolonged period of time so we gotta have like a room down here this could be like the quarters area you know where we can like you know put all the different furniture and stuff we need we can get this area all done up like that really nice if we wanted to who knows we'll see it really depends on what we can end up doing here like we have a lot that we need to think about still like how like how do i just do i decide to get other people down here if we do like how do i choose who comes down do i just let everybody in like i don't know different things like that we're gonna need to figure out but first let's of course just get finished on the walls of this area down here because honestly that'll be a huge enough accomplishment like all we need to do is get the framework all laid out here and then that'll be a success for the day which is great because that's what we're after we need to get all of this done and we might be running out of iron blocks pretty soon i believe so we might need to change up that a little bit nope we have another stack left okay hopefully this will be all we need because well we don't really have a lot more iron i'm gonna be honest and you know we kind of need it because it's really strong and powerful and it's you know the resource that is literally entirely surrounding the missile so you know there, there's got to be a reason for that like for sure like they chose that for a purpose when i guess when the overseer was designing the vault or whoever put the missile there honestly i can't believe no one knew there's a missile in the vault for the longest of ever like literally and here we go that is the vault room down here now we need to go ahead and get some lights because otherwise we're gonna have some lighting situations here we're gonna have some problems so let's go ahead and get back up we gotta get some lights and then we'll of course handle the all okay we're going back down and we'll handle all the decorative elements like you know getting the get, getting all the different stuff like the, the beds and all the storage and the food and 
you know all the things we're gonna need for a prolonged period of time and we're down there we can always handle that at a later date because like right now like we got priorities you know like we need to just get this thing done and ready to go or else we're gonna have a problem so let's do that and yeah, let's do that uh no i thought should just put these above the door i'm thinking because i know it's off centered so there's that but whatever it'll be fine and then we gotta go down here and then down here we gotta light it up too we're gonna light up this whole wall right there and then we're gonna go boom boom I'll throw one there too there we go so overall our, we're starting to rebuild the vault but what else do we need to add to this i don't really know we shall see i guess